My name is Yariti, I'm 15 years old. I'm very excited and nervous for my game today. I've been planning my quinceanera for like a year now and it's been very like stressful. What inspired me about a quinceanera was ever since my sister had her quince, I've always wanted one. What I really liked was the big hall, the dress and all the dancing and interacting with the family and friends. Well, during the presentation, I was able to be kind of a part of it. I gave her the pillow and we got to dance together and have fun. What I'm gonna have that's different from hers, I'll dance with my dad, my mom, and my sister. And then I'm gonna dance with my dog. We gotta practice for my big day, go on. My dog is Alvin, that's like my best friend. One Halloween, I wanted to take Alvin trick-or-treating with me. So me and my mom went to the store and I saw this little mariachi costume. I ended up getting it and everybody was just like, oh my God, he's just, he looks so adorable. Slob it on me. Yaddy. Yeah. Look at this dress. Look, I like the style of this dress. Look. What do you think? Mom, I don't really like that. You don't? Mm -mm. You really think we're gonna find something like what you're wanting? Yeah, I think we can find it. What I think the perfect dress is, it has to be nice, it has to be big, it has to grab people's attention while, like, when you're wearing it, the day of the party. A high neck, and I want it to have a lot of diamonds, off the shoulder, big, and just something I'll look good in. Well, I like that. You don't like that? The style of it? Mm -mm. No. The ruffles on the side are ugly. Oh, gosh. Okay. I'm uh, Araceli, the mother of the quinceañera. These past couple of weeks have been very stressful um, because of the planning of the quinceañera, of course. My mom is feeling really stressful right now. Like, she's just like, ugh, like her head is just, you know, all over the place. She's like, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Oh my God, are you serious? Why are you just now calling me? It's like two days before the event and you're, you can't find the flowers? The lady from the hall just called. I had one of Midnight Blue Flowers and she said she couldn't find them, she couldn't order them. It just upsets me because she just didn't make sure if they had them. I'm concerned that I'm not gonna have any flowers. The experience on, on this time around with my daughter's quinceañera versus my first daughter, I think it's been a lot more stressful just with the whole organizing, planning, and a bit of the finances because finances have changed, of course. Um, but it's, it's my last one, she's my baby, so I don't care. <laughs> Here, go ahead and take these. Y'all can start eating on these. Hey, okay, so for the quinceañera, you got everything? Uh... Oh my God, no, you know what? I still, I still have one more payment to go and we still need to get those, those um, candles for, the, for the, the decorations on the table. The main difficulty for me has been um, the decrease in, my, in, in income. There was a job change and, you know, it, of course it wasn't the same, but here we are and my baby's gonna have her quince. <laughs> You're ready to eat? Thank you, Mika. Yes. yes. I'm so sorry. My name is Juana Lara Schrader. I'm my uh, granddaughter is the quinceañera. I'm very proud of my baby girl because it's my baby. I have four grandmothers and she's the baby. My grandma is going to put the crown on me. I'm not too sure of the meaning of the crown. So if you ask me personally, that's my little princess. So my mother uh, is going to be crowning her. The crown means it's the queen. Oh, the, the, it's the day, it's the day for, the, for all the family and everybody is the queen for the day. So Yadi, your long day, your eight and a half years of your sister's quince is now upon yours and it's like almost the day of. No lo puedo creer. Finally now. here. Look, look at this. I remember when she was born. 
Remember when we went to go see our house, bro? Yeah, she was born on my birthday. This is me, guys. We know she was born on your birthday. Remember, we were like, we have your birthday present, and you were like, no, God wants that. She's still Look at it, Yari. Mira, esta, dude. Mira, Mari, esta, dude. I know this is the. When I'm around my family, I'm quiet and I'm way more different than when I'm with my friends because when I'm with my family, I only speak if I'm spoken to. She's home picking her nose here. Yeah. <laughs> That's look at her hair. Yeah. Girl, look at this one in Miami. Oh she, was my not, God. she was not afraid to dance. Look at her. She had the crowd all around her because she was dancing like the lady was singing and she was just <laughs> dancing away. The history of where the quinceanera comes from, it's a Mexican culture. Um, I mean, it's a tradition. It's basically you're introducing your baby girl to the society as a young adult. Um, and it's, in the Hispanic culture, it's very important. Yeah, I need to go, I, I still need to go and make that, that last payment. That last payment, but then Chata's gonna get here, so I don't know. I did not have a quinceanera because I got married very young to my husband of 27 years. We have four kids. My oldest, which is Hector Jr., Idalis, which is 23, she's my middle child, and then my son Alejandro, which is 20, and then my baby Yaritzi. Ever since my first daughter had her quinceanera eight years ago, my daughter literally for like a year and a half would just watch videos of, on YouTube of surprise dances and dresses and whatever, and now it's like, Yadi, it's, it's time. This is your, your quinceanera, you know, so we're excited. My mother's still around and she has been incredibly helpful. Her and my sister have been like my backbone through this whole experience because like I said, finances have definitely changed from the first time and they've, I, there's no words. They've been there for me. Whatever you need us for, to do, I mean, we, we got you. You know, we're family and we're here to help you with any, anything. I mean, the yeah. payment or I mean, whatever it is. I really, really appreciate y'all. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you, bro. I'm very excited and nervous because I feel like I'm gonna mess up in any one of the dances or I feel like I'm gonna trip and fall in my heels when I'm dancing the waltz or dancing with my dad. Next thing you know, you're gonna be looking at the videos of you and the guys dancing and stuff. You ready? Yeah, I'm excited. You gonna show up, it's your time to shine. It's your time to shine, it's your day, it's your night, it's all about you. So it's a once in a lifetime experience, so you better have fun. I just want everything to come out perfect for my big day. We saw some shoes that I thought would be perfect. They're hideous. I don't like them. <laughs> Are you serious? They look like grandma shoes. Or I'm not gonna wear them. You wear whatever you want. I'm not gonna <gasps> spend no more money. I am done with this. I'm, I'm so done with this.